A company that has been providing jobs in Roswell for decades is closing its doors. Tough economic times have forced the well-known candy company to move its business somewhere else. Here's News 13's Gabrielle Burkhart. The sweet smell generated from Impact Confections Candy Factory will no longer linger in Roswell. Yesterday, company officials announced plans to consolidate operations with their sister company in Wisconsin, leaving more than 80 employees here without jobs. Well, it has been here for over 30 years, and it's a huge disappointment any time when you can lose you know, manufacturing or food processing type jobs. The factory manager declined to go on camera but told me the move was strictly economic and has nothing to do with the city or quality of work. Many employees have been with the company for nearly 20 years. Bob Donnell with the county's Economic Development Corporation said their prospects of finding a new job are good. We do have a number of job openings now in Chavez County. So it's, it's not like they're there aren't opportunities, but it's always a huge disappointment when an individual has worked for a company as long as many of them have, you know, to lose their position. The factory is set to close at the end of September, and when it does, the 100,000 square foot building will be left empty. But if things work out, it won't be empty for long. There are already three prospects for the facility. If we were fortunate and be selected for that company to relocate here, it could be over 400 jobs. The, the downside is yes. There are issues going on where we're going to lose one, but we're hopeful that we can attract somebody else to look at that building. So even though the machines will stop and the people will move on, both the city and factory had this message to share. The workforce out there now need to be commended. They're a tremendous workforce. They're very dedicated to their job, and they have given a lot to the city. In Roswell, Gabrielle Burkhart, KRQE News 13. Some employees have expressed interest in relocating with the company. A few said they may go back to school. The factory has also been working with Eastern New Mexico University to offer employees new training.